at you. Give us a pickety boo then. Blimey. It was in the sale. Don't wanna know. You don't think it's a bit too, you know. Listen, I have clinched many a deal with my cleavage. <laughs> not that I'm expecting you to do that, no, no. If you start talking business, change the subject. Look, I know I've not been there long, but I have been in on the meetings, you know. I'm not total airhead. No, I'm not saying you are. It's just what with me not being there. He might try and drive you down on price. Will you stop worrying? Now go on, get back to work. Go and enjoy your butter. I'll be thinking of you while I'm having my fancy dinner. <laughs> Prehensile toast? Yeah. I'm not kidding, right. She can pick up drinks for them. There was this one time where she had six pina coladas lined up in front of I don't of think her. we should order. Yeah. yeah, well, I'm gonna get the sweet and sour pork. I'll just nip to bog. I'll tell you in a minute. Yeah, right. All right, can't wait. I'm just wondering what else she can do with them. <laughs> Sorry. I hope we don't go on about her all night. Yeah, well, at least it means he's moving on from you, isn't it? Oh, true. Yeah. Oh, there, Sheen. Hiya. Hi. You want to order? Um, yeah. No, never mind that. How are you? Oh, fine, yes. And how are you managing with rent? Well, um, I felt rotten that we couldn't help you last time. Yeah, we're, um, we're sorry about that. It's all right. I'm looking for somewhere cheaper. Any luck with a new job? Not yet. But it's okay. That's the spirit. Right, we'll have a sweet and sour pork, chicken chow mein. It's just because you were so upset last time, I've been worried about you. I'm, I'm fine, honest. Good. And we'll have one king prawn and cashew with, um, with fried rice, please. Cheers. Is that all you can think about? Food? <laughs> it's a restaurant. And can't you see she's upset? She said she's fine. Oh, man. Hi. Well, you're punctual. Uh, is that a problem? No, no, it's just that the food's not ready. Well, it was until I dropped it. <laughs> see, now, if that was my mum, she'd have picked it up, dusted it off and would be none the wiser. Yeah, well, it's a bit difficult to dust off a souffle, especially when off it's all over the floor. Ah. Uh. Anyway, sorry, come in, come in. Come on, it's a big drop. Okay, look, um, let me think about it and I'll call you back. Yeah. Okay. Yes! <laughs> Honey, we have had an offer on the Swinton shop. How much? Well, a couple of grand less than we wanted, but I think we should, uh, we should accept, no? So do I. Yeah. Let's ring them no, back. No, 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 no. No, you don't want them to think you're desperate, no. We are. Yes, I know, but you don't want them to think that you are. No, we just, we leave it for an hour, right? Make them sweat a bit, yeah? Well, I feel awful. <sighs> don't be daft. It's a bit rubbish though, isn't it, having to make your own dinner? I don't mind, honest. Just make sure you get that up before it sets hard. Yeah. My mum always said I was cack-handed, you know. Frank, she would say, you will amount to nout. Well, you've proved her wrong there, haven't you? Yeah. Um, where's your frame pan? Second row, yeah. Yeah. I could be a multi-millionaire and she still said I was a failure. You don't get on then? Well, we didn't. She's dead now. Oh, I'm sorry. It's okay. I still feel her looking down at me though, you know, disapproving. Well, I think all mothers can be hard to please. Mine would have had a way, she'd have chained me to the kennels. The kennels? Yeah, it was the um, <clears throat> family business. Right, so you were a kennel maid as well as a hairdresser. There's my street cred out the window. No, I don't be daft. I've done loads in my time. I worked on the parks after I left school and then I spent a couple of years lugging bags of coal. Really? Hmm. Even when I joined the family business, I had to start on the factory floor, work my way up. But I think it's good, you know? It stops you taking things for granted. Yeah, well, that's true. Still, don't you go telling Carla that I told you that. Oh, no. It's our little secret. You won't believe, like, how many friends she's got online. It's in the thousands. Well, I'm not surprised when she's a cage dancer. No, it's just because she's dead popular. Well, we do see opposites of chance. <laughs> Thanks. Where are you going? Well, I've seen you all night. Great. What? She's busking you grief. No. He wasn't very pleased when I got upset last time. He says it's not good for business. Oh, so that's why he's been avoiding us all night. Sorry. No, don't be daft. 
Right, it's gone now anyway, so tell us what's happened, because I know something has. Go on. No. <clears throat> I went for an interview yesterday. Yeah? Mm -hmm. But I didn't get it. Oh. She um, wants to be a psychiatric nurse. Hey, you could practice on Dave any time. Graham! Well, if you just stick at it, you'll get there eventually. You don't understand. I need to get a job now. My visa extension runs out in two months. But you've got a job. Here. Yeah, well, it needs to be what I trained for, otherwise they won't let me stay. Are you kidding? Well, that's not fair, is it? It's not like you're claiming benefits. No, when you work dead hard. Well, young people leave uni and then can't find a job. Yeah, they're English. Oh, I take it you don't want to go back to China then? No family, and all my friends are here, but I have no choice. I'll get the change. Well, I can't believe you rustled that up out of nothing. Oh, well, I'm used to doing meals on the cheap. One wage and I'll have to bring up. And you don't look old enough to have a kid. <laughs> Give over. I mean it. So you're a single parent then? In a manner of speaking, yeah. Can't be easy. No. So, do you have any kids? I'd much rather talk about you, Maria. Oh, um, look, you're a lovely man, Frank, but I've got a boyfriend. He doesn't mind you being here. Why should I? He now say it's only business. Yeah. Sorry. Well, he's a very lucky man. OK, let's talk shop. I think the sample's brilliant. And I've no doubt you'll do me a good job. We will. I've got a couple of questions, though. Well, Firstly, I'm thinking of diversifying, not just lingerie, but nightwear. If I was to put future orders your way, I need to know you're adaptable enough to handle it. Well, yeah, absolutely. I mean, Carl is really keen on expanding our lines. Good. Next question, what's the best price you can give me? Um, I thought we'd agreed on the price. Yeah, well, it's a competitive world out there, Maria, and there's lots of businesses that are jump at this. Well, we'd have to think about it. All right. I thought you were both keen. I'm keen, and maybe we can wrap this deal up tonight. Look, Maria, if you don't think you can handle it, I can wait and speak to Carla. No, no. No, it's OK. Um, I just need to nip to the bathroom first, mm. though. Yeah, of course. Um, up the stairs first on the right. Hey, how's it going? Yeah. I've almost cracked it. What's the lowest we can drop to? I knew it. No, I'm gone. We've already agreed a price. Yeah, but Carl, it's not about giving us more orders. Going into nightwear and stuff? Are you kidding? No. OK, look, negotiate. But do not drop by more than 5p per unit. All right, OK. Wish me luck. Good luck. <laughs> All on your lonesome? Yep. Oh. Well, if you fancy any company, you know where I am. What can I get you? Brandy, please, Tracy. Yeah? Sure. Cheers. Thank you. I'm not far. The whole street used to hate me, but now they all hate you instead. Looks like even Steve's going off you. You are. We've had enough of you today. Come on, then. Leave me alone now. Well, you can tell she used to live on the streets, can't you? Well, once a low life, always a low life. That's the best we can do, I'm afraid. We need to be able to make some profit. Of course. Yeah. Uh, no, thanks, I'm fine. It's all right, you're not driving. No, I know, but I'm fine, honestly. So, what do you say? Do we have a deal? Well, I've nearly made my mind up but not quite. I hope you're not stringing me along, Frank. I hope you're not either. What are you doing? Let's not pretend, eh? What's this? I put out you sign. Forget it. Come on, Maria. I can't believe you think that of me. I told you I've got a boyfriend. Yeah, well, I'm not after a relationship. Just a bit of fun, eh? Yeah, well, I'm not. So why are you here, then, eh? All glammed up. I'm going. Maria, hey. What are you doing? It's OK. Uh, 
睇嘢。系。阿姐。Yes。Naked。How did it go, Tracy? Absolute doddle. Good. You all right, Miss? Just take me home. Scott told me once that weird stuff was happening around the house. The kind of stuff that's been happening to me. What if we move? Including Alice. Alice is gone. She's here in the house. And she's not going quietly. The concluding part of Marchlands is next tonight.